A. So let's solve this problem. So to find the periodic payments of an ordinary annuity, then we have this problem. Monthly payment of the future value of 50,000 pesos for one year with an interest rate of 10% compounded monthly. So to find the periodic payment or the monthly payment, since the given is a future value, so we're going to use this formula to find the periodic payment. Then from this problem, so these are the given, the future value is 50,000 pesos one year for the time. Interest rate, that's 10% for the rate. Since compounded monthly, so M equals 12. So first, we need to find the interest rate per period, that's J equals R, and the rate is 10%, convert this one to decimal, that's 0 0.10, so 0 0.10, then over M, M is 12, so to solve now for J, we have 0 0.10, divide by 12, equals, so that's 0 0.0083, so, J is equal to 0.0083. Then, for the number of payments or the number of periods, that's N. So, we have M. M is 12 times the time. N time is 1. So, the number of payments or the number of periods is 12. So to solve now for the regular payment or the periodic payment, that's R equals the future value, that's 50,000 pesos times J. And J is 0 0.0083 then over. So 1 plus J, 0 0.0083 to the power n, n is 12, then minus 1. Then to solve now for the regular payment, so we need to find the value for the numerator first. So we have 50,000 times 0 0.0083 equals, that's 415. So we have 415 then over, this denominator, so this 1 plus 0 0.0083, that's 1.0083, then to the power 12, equals then minus 1, equals, that's 0 0.10427, so we have 0 0.10427, and to find now the regular payment, so we have 415, then divide by 0 0.10, 427 equals, that's 3980.05. So the regular payment is 3980.05. Then for this problem, since the given is the present value, so this is the formula to find the periodic payment. And from this problem, so the given are the present value. Two years is the time. Interest rate, that's uh, R, 12%. And since semi-annually, so therefore M, is equal to 2. So twice in a year. So first, we need to find the interest rate per period, that's J, equals R, and this 12% in decimal, that's 0 0.12. So 0 0.12 over M, M is 2. So we have 0 0.12 divided by 2, 
equals that 0 0.06. So 0 0.06 and to solve for the number of payments, that's M times the time. So M is 2 and the time is 2. So the number of payments is equal to 4. So to find out the regular payment or the periodic payment, so that's R, equals the present value is 100,000 then times J 0 0.06 then over 1 minus the quantity of 1 plus J that's 0 0.06 to the power negative N and N is equal to 4. So to solve now for J, so we need to simplify first this numerator. So we have 100,000 times 0 0.06 equals that 6,000. So we have 6,000 then over. So this denominator, so that's 1 minus, this is 1.06 then to the power negative 4 then equals that 0 0.2791 so 0 0.2791 and to find now the regular payment that 6000 Divide by 0 0.20791 equals that's 28,858.64. So 28,858.64 pesos.